Surrounded by ancient woods in the north of England, perched between the Ashby Valley and the sea, the house sits on the highest point for miles around. Ever since the Iron Age people have lived here, early farmers, Roman soldiers, Viking settlers. 400 years ago, give or take, a rich merchant built his manor here and named it after the great birds which circled its cliffs and woodlands. The manor was burnt down in one war, rebuilt, bombed in another war, rebuilt again. The new house is square, white, and a lot scruffier than it was, but that's not the point. The point is, it's a place people come back to. It's a place people fight for. I'm Natasha Farrant, and the author of this book, The Rescue of Ravenwood, as well as this book, which is uh, in English called The Girl Who Talked to Trees. And I'm so happy to be coming to Cuneo in November for Scrittor in Città to talk to you um, principally about this book, The Rescue of Ravenwood. Um, Ravenwood is one of the world's precious places. It's a home for a human family, um, but it's also a place where birds and nature and animals are safe, where humans and nature can live side by side in harmony. Um, it's a special place, so when it comes under attack, the people who live there, are um, they will stop at nothing to defend it and to make sure that it's, to make sure that it's safe. Um, and I guess it asks the questions, what places are precious to us um, and what we would do to defend them too. So I really hope that I will be seeing you in Cuneo in November and that we can have this conversation about the precious places in the world and the stories we tell about them. Thank you and see you soon. Bye.